What is good people? Welcome back to another episode of Drive Time Crypto with me, Crypto Chris. And today we are discussing, is the Helium network in trouble? But just before I jump into the video, I am currently on the road to 100 subscribers. So if you could please do me a favor and subscribe to my channel and let me help me hit that goal, that would be really appreciated. With that being said, let's start the video. So... Yesterday, they announced that there is over 800,000 hotspots that have been deployed on the Helium network, which in itself is an amazing milestone. But that right there doesn't paint the correct picture. So yesterday and the day before, they launched their light hotspot miners. So if you are not aware of what that is, I'm not going to go into it. I have done another video on it. Please go back onto my channel and have a look at that video if you're not understanding what a light hotspot is. But they announced on their Discord that the light hotspot chain variables have been activated. Now, this is one of the little annoying things about Helium is the fact that they announce everything on Discord. So this is why I've done a video in case people aren't on Discord and they wanted a bit of an update. Nevertheless, they've, they've done the announcement that it got activated and they kept on doing the announcements and saying that the activation is going well, the core teams confirmed packet transfers and update two activation continues to go smoothly so every everything's looking well uh update three activation activation is still looking good so you, you're like okay this is this is all right um and then we started to see some bugs appearing of zero witnesses um i looked at my miner and i wasn't having any act activity whatsoever on the miner now i don't get that great returns i get modest returns it's in average of the network and but it's not phenomenal but it's not poor i've got an all right setup i've invested in it um so it was a bit odd to just see it flatline and do nothing so what i did is i thought well they're telling me everything's going all right on on discord so i went to reddit and I posted, is everybody's miner a potato? So since the upgrade to light miner, my sense cap has become a potato and isn't doing anything since. I'm connected instead of sync now because it used to show that your miner was synced, but now it uh, portrays the message connected. My miner has returned modest returns, as I've just said, in line with the network average. And I've checked all the miners around me and they are similar to me. In fact, one miner who was producing some great returns is now offline. I just wanted to get some general consensus around the com community, how they are getting on. I'm in Manchester, UK. So as you can see there, I, it, it it got unbelievable traction. I never even thought that it'd be this popular of a post. But the, the, the posts were very much the same. Yeah, basically I have 23 miners and have made a combined total of 0.59 of HNT in the past 24 hours. And you can keep going down there and the majority, I'd say 90% have said, yeah, nothing. I'm, I'm not getting anything. Um, so same, uh, had one big reward and then 16 hours, nothing. 20 hours of no activity for me. Uh, same with me for my 13 miners. Uh, can confirm my miner is a potato, same. So you, you're starting to understand um, that the a, a lot of people are saying, yeah, we're not getting anything. So then you start getting a bit concerned. But then you see stuff like rewards are up for me. Hopefully it's just a matter of time uh, for everybody. Six miners made 1.13. So when this post was developing and people was commenting, my miner actually did do something. So uh, 22 hours ago, I was a broadcast beacon and this returned, uh, if I go on activity here, this this returned back to me 0.213 of HNT, which is much more than um, you normally get for, for mining rewards. So whether that is because people aren't doing as well and you're getting a bigger share of the profit, etc., which isn't right, but that's what happened. So yeah, my, my miner returned and then you can see where it says transfer packets and receive mining rewards. I'll touch on that shortly. Um, but yeah, so I wanted to have a look around me. So this then brought me to a miner that's just by me who also did a broadcast beacon, said that, yes, I am broadcasting. But as you can see there, there is zero witnesses and he got 
no rewards for it whatsoever so then if we go back to discord when you start looking it you, you start understanding that zero witness receipts issued on the hotspot side had a fix last night but they were still showing that there was there's these issues going on um, and they kept on saying that there's there's update issues now one of the one of the major ones for me which was uh an update which concerned me um i'm just trying to trying to find it on the discord this is why i don't like discord you can get very lost in it um there is still 1000 validators 30 percent of all validators so one third of the network with their ports unopened and misconfigured an unopened port means this validator cannot receive proofs of coverage receipts from hotspots so that is i am saying i am providing proof of coverage and the validators aren't seeing it this negatively affects rewards and if your hotspot tried to send a receipt so this type of validator the rewards will still look like a flat line so th it's they've they've push for these validators to help the networks but then the validators aren't getting their 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 act together which is a bit concerning um they carried on doing updates um along the uh, along the time the core team has tagged another release for validators to improve i don't i'm not going to pretend that i know what that means and um the team are also testing a release that adds a retry delay when sending proof of coverage witness receipts from hotspots to validators. So that was what the packets were that got sent to the hotspots and um, that I showed you on my activity um, to, to, to update so that you keep on retrying. Last update for today. So this was at two o'clock this morning, UK time. Both validators and hotspot releases have gone out. Makers and validators will take the release overnight and the team will monitor proof of coverage and witness receipts if looks good we will endeavor to increase the challenges per block tomorrow so they have been reducing the amount of challenges that have been going on the blocks so the validators haven't been challenging as many geographical areas as they as the network was when it was all on the miners the challenges um but yeah i've had a look around some others and this miner is is just up the road from me and as you can see over the last 24 hours he has been witnessing stuff and there's the packets for the updates and he's been getting a steady reward coming through um he's also got he's got a good setup as you can see he's got some great coverage of witnesses and so um I think it is just the look of the draw at the moment. I don't think that it goes down to set up or where you are. I literally think it's the look of the draw at the moment. And the reason why I say that is because if we go to Rough Chili Bird, now this is one of the top performing miners on the network. As you can see, he uh, he or she always performs way over the network average. And then bang, yesterday they earn point. 315 of a HNC when normally they are good for a full HNC a day and what the reason why I said I, I think it is the look of the draw and you do not need to worry about the um the the setup that you've got because it's look of the draw if you are not familiar with rough chili bird um this is his setup it is a unbelievable setup. It is sat on a 30 meter mast. There's his antenna there. You can see in the middle of the screen. And that is why I'm saying if his rewards have been affected, it's not your setup. It's the look of the draw. So, yeah, please let me know in the comments um, if, you, if you've been affected, how it's affected you. If you're still being affected as it picked up, just just please give me some, some comments, a little bit of feedback. Um, and let me know what, what your thoughts are on the here. Helium network, helium. The the, the basically they are very confident that the. Um, the, the update's going well. It's got some bugs that they're working through. I genuinely believe that, yes, it probably is going well. And they have just got a few bugs. What we've got to remember is it's nuanced technology. So you are always going to get these teething problems as they try to upgrade and and better the network. So, yeah, it's... it's um, I wouldn't even say it's annoying the fact that we've 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 not seen any activity because you've got to understand when you get into this this is what could happen what's more i like about it is the fact that yeah it's it's happening 
but it's happening across the broad range but there is pockets of where it's showing that it is actually working so the network isn't in trouble it's just having a few teething problems it's working through them and i'm no doubt think that helium will be back up to how it was very very soon so yeah that's going to be it for this video i'm going to wrap it up now thank you so much for watching again if you are having any sort of issues or please let me know in the comments what your miner is doing and if i could ask you to give me a like on this video and even better if you could subscribe to my channel to help me get to a hundred subscribers that would be really appreciated until next time thanks very much bye